What up guys, 5 marijuana penny stocks you need to be watching in 2018 before they spike. Uh, but before I begin guys, I want to say thanks to everyone that has liked, commented and subscribed um, to my channel. I appreciate every single person um, and I'm glad you're here on this video and I want you to do the same thing for this year because we're going to have more videos and we want to make profit together um, and most of the dislikes that I get on my videos is probably from YouTubers that have basically I'm releasing their secrets their secrets to their courses and I'm probably breaking down their business right now apart so in these videos guys I teach you the right way to trade penny stocks uh, and also give you some hints and tips so every video I have here is very valuable so let's begin with the five penny stocks now guys remember what I told you pharmaceutical companies have basically a drugs and trials and they have to test new products um, and get FDA approved before being released so that's the catalyst, the trial, the success of a trial, the success of a, basically the FDA approval. If they're FDA approved, then that stock is going to spike in value. If they're not, then that stock is going to slump. So I know I've said it in every video so far, this statement, but if you're new, I want to kind of explain it to you, what the catalyst is. Um, and that's what other YouTubers will try to teach you, is that catalyst. So the catalyst for a pharmaceutical penny stock is the success of a positive um, trial or not. So if this trial is positive, FDA approved, then that stock will spike in value. And that's what affects most pharmaceutical companies. Okay, so let's begin. Five marijuana penny stocks you need to be watching. All of these stocks are trading under $2, um, except one of them because it has a product ready. Um, so most of these stocks are in the stage of research and development, but also in, in trials, having trials already and FDA approval. And they do have assets, however, and one of my favorite stocks here, I'm going to tell you why it's my favorite stock when I begin talking about it. So let's begin. Cannabis Science, guys, that is CBIS. It's an OTC stock, it's a pharmaceutical penny stock, trading at uh, basically 11 cents. Um, it's a biotech company based in California. The company was incorporated into 2009 and trades publicly under the ticker CBIS. Um, so what is CBIS, guys? Right now, it's at the stage of research and development. However, there's few news surrounding it. There is one from 2018, January 08. Cannabis Science prepares for the grand opening of its first two pre-ICO pharmacies in prime high traffic areas. So, there's a lot of news surrounding it, guys. And it also wants to basically federal government contract and is preparing an application for submission while confirming the CBI's CBIS security team is ready for action. So they're basically taking a federal contract from the government to begin producing um, and whatnot. So these stocks, guys, most of them, they basically, they're high in debt, they're lacking revenue, they're already in losses, deep losses, and most stocks are like that, most penny stocks, even the ones that are basically like Amazon and whatnot, they all started off with debt. So there's no need of looking at, at basically the te technical or the fundamentals as in um, numbers because most of them will be uh, knee deep in debt and whatnot because they're just developing so there's no need for that however what we look at is future development fundamentally as in the news that I've just read out to you you know the trials the products importantly the products that they have to develop the more products they get approved for the better for the stock the better for the company so that is a good stock to, to basically watch out for guys, CBIS, and it's trading at 11 cents a share. So, it's affordable, there's a lot of news surrounding it, so have a look. Second stock, United Cannabis Corporation, traded at $1.76. It's an OTC as well, that is CNAB, that is the ticker guys. So that stock also has great potential for the future guys. Uh, like I said, you need to be watching these stocks guys just look at do your research the more news they come out with the more products the more basically trials they come out with the better for the company because this will mean that basically the company is growing it's expanding um, so at cannabis science we use an inquiry approach to discover and develop novel cannabin cannabinoid based therapies to improve patients lives so they're using Cannabis to basically develop products to improve sick people's lives. Third stock guys is Maple Leaf Green World. That is my favorite stock um, and it's trading in Canada. It's $1.33 Canadian dollars um, trading on the CVE stock exchange and that ticker is MGW. 
So why is it my favorite stock? For the simple reason, guys, they own assets, they own farms, they own marijuana farms. Now, any company that owns its own farms and basically manufactures its own products, that is a great company, basically great potential to be acquired by big companies. So, let's say Pfizer comes in one day and says, okay, we're, we're expanding into the marijuana sector, we need assets. They're gonna look at companies like this, Maple Leaf Green World Inc. So, that is a stock you need to be watching. If I, actually this is a stock I'm gonna add to my portfolio. It traded at $1.34 and I probably won't care even if it doesn't come out with positive trials. It's traded at $1.34 and it's, that's very good for a stock like that. It already spiked guys from 50 cents, 50 cents to $1.91 and it pulled back to $1.35. So, that, that happened in January 3rd. So here is the news coming surrounding this stock guys. It's a great stock you need to be watching for 2018 and you don't need to look at trials for this one. InMed Pharmaceuticals Inc. traded at $1.70. It's also a Canadian stock and you can see most Canadian stocks are marijuana uh, focused at the moment just because it's legalized in Canada and also we'll see more countries legalizing these um, medical marijuana. And when that happens, guys, we will see great increase of marijuana stocks, marijuana penny stocks, and the one that already exists now, they're going to spike in value because there's now a potential and there's now a big market for these stocks to sell their products and drugs. So that's the explanation for these marijuana penny stocks. We don't really, yes, we need FDA approved drugs. Yes, we need to look at products that have companies that have products out there. But here's one that does have a product and it's called Axum. Um, so Axum is traded at nine. Dollars forty cents, I believe. Um, and what is Axum? Basically, it manufactures just it's like Nicorette in a way. Now, um, there's one basically pipeline, one drug they have called Chow Wow, I think. Uh, basically, it's a chewing gum made of cannabis where you chew it just like the Nicorette one, and you put it under your teeth, um, and it gives you the same basically um, feeling you would get from smoke a weed. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you again in another video. However, make sure you leave the subscribe, make sure you leave the likes, and I love you guys.